Okay, hey, welcome to the International Center for Studies and Creativity, 635 Creativity and Change Leadership Forum. Today we have three presenters with us, and I'll introduce them in a second. But this is the first of five forums, and we're excited to bring our alumni in and ask them to talk a little bit about uh, uh, their work that they do in their profession. This forum is about teaching and learning. And we're excited to have uh, Lena Lamatina. And Lena is the director of the Best Center. Nancy Cook, who is a technology facilitator at Casey Middle School in uh, Williamsville. And Kara Swabel, who is the director of differentiated instruction at Canisius College. So what I'll ask is our presenters will um, introduce themselves. And then I'll ask them a couple questions. We'll, they'll share a little bit. Um, just as a conversation starter, the questions are. And from there, we'll open it up so that our students in the Creativity and Change Leadership course can share as well. So thank you. Thank you for coming. And just say a little bit about who you are and what you do. OK. My name is Lena Lamatina. I am currently uh, one of the directors at the BEST Center at Genesee Community College. BEST stands for Business and Employee Skills Training. I didn't make it up, but uh, it seems to work for us. Um, and what I do there is I work one-on-one -on -one with organizations. And my role is to um, work with each organization, uh, assess their skill gaps, and then design programs uh, that will help them uh, to fill those gaps. Um, so partly it's um, designing training programs. There's some consulting that happens. I also help them to um, uh, tap into any training funds that might be out there. Uh, so uh, it really is business um, oriented. I also have a background in human resources and operations management uh, as well. Um, but currently, I'm at Genesee Community College. And Lena has also taught courses in creative studies mm -hmm. over a period of many years right. with us. Yes, I taught here for five years. Um, I've been teaching at Medi College in the undergraduate as well as the uh, master's program uh, there um, for about nine years now. Uh, so it's, uh, I do enjoy uh, teaching and, and uh, you know, working with non-traditional students as well as traditional students. Thanks. Thank you. Nancy? Um, I'm currently a technology facilitator at a middle school. Uh, it's a fun job. It's a great job. Um, but before that, I was a gifted specialist for 20 years. and. Um, that was what I used my creative studies degree mostly for the gifted programming but now with as a tech facilitator it's the same thing it's facilitating and helping teachers um, plan their lessons and use the technology but it's still all about the um, learning to learn skills and things like that so I, I work during the day at Casey Middle School and um, also teach at UB um, educational technology and educational psychology and at Damon teach research classes at, at Damon and Nancy just finished her doctorate just a little oh, while ago oh, so congratulations. Yay. <laughs> <laughs> I'm Kara Schwabel um, I'm the director of differentiated instruction which is um, an exciting new program it's about three years old um, they're gonna be going into our fourth year at Canisius College and um, it was really a wonderful fit um, I actually was a uh, gifted and talented coordinator in Batavia School District for seven years and then I uh, went to finish my master's in creative studies and um, this uh, serendipitous situation um, just came about and it's really um, a perfect a perfect fit I find that creativity um, is just creativity and differentiated instruction is just a, a perfect marriage and um, as part of heading up the program, I also instruct. Um, and so we teach teachers coming back for their master's um, in, in DI, as we call it, and um, just give them a skill base to be able to go into their much diverse classrooms and um, be able to meet the needs of all those kids and ensure that they learn something new every day. And I've worked with these ladies for a long time. And they really, that's just the tip of the iceberg the kind of things that they're doing now and the kind of things that they've done before. So it's really, it's great that you came for the first forum and uh, kind of be a guinea pig with us. So <laughs> thanks. Yeah. yeah <laughs> uh, 
So what I, what I did is I formulated two questions just as a conversation starter, and each of you take about five minutes or so to, to say a bit uh, a bit about it. We can go back and forth a little bit because uh, we have about a 20-minute time frame, and then we'll open it up for questions. Uh, so uh, what I'd like to, if you think about your area of focus, and this, this forms about teaching and learning, but you have a very rich background uh, and lots of experiences. Uh, in your professional life. Uh, and as you think about how your creativity experience assisted you in your, in your area of focus, that's one of the questions. And the other has been, uh, the other is, what was the easiest and hardest aspect of your journey? When you look at going through a master's in, uh, of science and creativity and going out and doing all these things and being an advocate for creativity, what was easy and what was hard? So nothing too hard, huh? Yeah, no, 